Hey guys, welcome back to All Unknown Law. This is Quake Orthopedics. And today we're gonna talk about the syphilis of the joints. We're gonna brief you with the syphilis of joints. Okay? So you know syphilis is a sexually transmitted disease. So it's gonna affect in two stages, two types, or you can call it as one is a congenital can affect during the congenital infection or either it can be due to what you call acquired okay in the congenital it can affect into one is early and the late early and a late if it's early means it's during infancy it can cause osteochondritis osteochondritis in the juxta epiphyseal region resulting in the breakdown of the bone and the cartilage okay juxta epiphyseal region remember in a late late as a late manifestation the clutton's joint clutton's joint is a painless synovitis okay that occurs at the puberty remember and it most commonly affects the knee and the elbow joint but bilaterally remember okay knee and the elbow joint bilaterally clutton's joint what we call painless synovitis occurring at the puberty if you talk about the acquired the joint may be affected in the secondary or tertiary stage of the what you call acquired syphilis like we have a primary secondary and tertiary the joint are affected more commonly in a secondary and the tertiary okay in a primary you have only the what you call lesions like shanker right uh, so here ulcerated lesions here you can secondary and tertiary you can get what you call uh, the joints are affected in this syphilis in the secondary stage the transient polyarthritis transient polyarthritis okay transient polyarthritis and polyarthralgia involving the large joints occur whereas in tertiary in tertiary stage the gammatous arthritis the gammatous The gametous arthritis occurs where the large joints are often involved, okay? So in a secondary transient polyarthritis and polyarthralgia involving the larger joints, okay? In tertiary stage, gametous arthritis occurs in the larger joints, okay? And one of the consequences of the syphilis is the Charcot's joint. We made a different video on that to try to watch that. Charcot's joint, okay? Neuropathic joint, okay, is an indirect consequence of the syphilis, right, guys? So these are the basic what you call a simple, brief information about the syphilis involving the joints. Okay, guys. So thank you so much for watching this video. Take care.